Okay, so we picked this uh, light up here at Aldi's. Um, it is a Bluetooth audio color changing LED. It, um, you hook it up to your phone and it changes like, I don't know, over a thousand colors, I guess, to the music. So I'm going to do a little unboxing here of it and then um, hook it up and do a little review and see how well it is and how well it works. Um, basically, here, here it is. Um, it's all you get, I guess. I don't know, maybe some instructions here. A little plastic container. You get the, uh, the light bulb. And you get some paperwork. Um, I don't know what any of this stuff is. You get a warranty card. You get... A, um, Spanish, make sure Spanish warranty card, and you get some instructions. So now we'll figure out how this thing works. I don't know, I just took all the bulbs out of my chandelier so we can put this one in and we'll take a look first just how exactly it uh, looks when you screw it in and turn it on. Okay, so there it is. Now going to it actually provides some pretty good light um, it's not too bad reminds you of an LED light that you would buy just a standard light so the lighting isn't too bad with it but basically you install it in the light socket which I've already done um, and it says it the lights gonna light up and then there's an audio sound I didn't catch the audio sound, so I'm not sure if it did it. Okay, so there it is. But then the next step is, is you have to go to the App Store and you have to download the Median BT LED Bulb and Speaker app. So, I guess that's the next step. The app was really easy to find. You type in media and it comes right up. It's free. You download it into your smartphone. This is Android based and Apple based. Um, it says to open the app up, I have to go to my uh, settings now and turn on my Bluetooth. So now it says to allow this to access my music. Obviously, I wanted to do that. So let's access that. It wants to access the speaker for alerts, whatever. Okay, let me go find the Bluetooth now. Bluetooth on. And supposedly it's supposed to pick it up. And actually, it's right there. That um, is saying it's it, so click it. It just connected, it just made a noise. So now, I should be able to go to the device list. And, ah, you gotta click search on the app. And now, guessing yep I can now control the light with the app I can change the colors if you can see it in the background on the white paper I can kinda 
change it to the different stuff. And um, give me one second here. I will spin it up to the light. And now I can access the different colors of the light. can actually dim the light I can shut the light off actually works pretty nice for um, looks like you can do lighting effects you can do all kinds of stuff I can actually just click a button it will flip through the different standard shades. There's the regular light again. I don't know what these lighting effects are. Here's a dancing. Here's a stars. Here's a romantic. Here's a rainbow. Here's, I guess, what you would call a strobe light. They say flashing. Here's breathing. Here's morning. Here's night lamp. Here is reading. Pretty bright for reading, but okay. So now I'm going to try this music. And the only thing I have in my iPhone is the free U2 music. So we'll give it a shot. I don't know. I went back over to the app and when I went back over to the app I clicked on play music and now it works. And, um, right now that is uh, there's the music light and actually right now this speaker is all the way up. I have it completely turned up, so that's as loud as it's going to get. Which is pretty loud. I mean, it takes a little bit to talk over it. And then you can control the volume with the app. Um, um, you can also set up a sleep assistant. So I guess you can actually have an alarm to where when you go to bed, this light will shut off. There's an alarm that you can set so that the light will turn on. Um, there is a blue light, here we go, red light maybe. Um, and then, like I said, there was the lighting effects. All in all, the uh, this thing is uh, pretty nifty, the way everything's set up and it's... Uh, very simple to use um, looks like this app if you would have more than one of these you can actually select each light bulb that you would have and do different stuff with each light bulb in in uh, separately but um, I don't know it seems to work pretty pretty good for what I've been playing around with here for the last couple minutes and I don't know anything about these things so this is all new to me just uh, as we're going here there's the uh, music effect again it, um, like I said there's a ton of stuff that you can do with this thing um, you can actually set it up so that while it's playing, if you shake your phone, it'll go to the next song. 
Um, you can have it do all kinds of stuff if you shake the phone. But, I would say that I would recommend this for as cheap as it is, for something you can throw in a bathroom or a accent light in a living room to play some music at certain times, it's pretty cool. Uh, we're actually going to use this above our spa. Um, that way we can have some music and um, accent lighting, stuff like that. Our spa actually has lights built into it, so this will sort of add to that effect. And it'll be kind of neat but all in all um, I did find these are available on Amazon I will put a link in the description it's not the exact light but from what I've seen it looks pretty much like the same light so I'll throw that link in there you can check that out and um, if you liked my uh, video here it's so, you know, show me if you like it or not. Give me a thumbs up or, uh, and uh, subscribe to my channel if you, uh, if you like this. And make sure you uh, shoot a comment down in the video and tell me what I should have done better or anything. I love constructive crit criticism, so throw it at me. But uh, you have a good day, good night, good evening, wherever you're at, whatever you're doing. See you in the next one.